First, I'd like to thank Kathy and Michette for introducing me to this incredible group of smart and accomplished women. I really am humbled to be part and considered part of this group, and in the back of my head, I'm doing that whole yippee thing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on, it's way cool. <laughs> But I'd also like to thank you for the recognition for Engineers Without Borders, and especially the University of Hartford chapter. You know, in this time of global uncertainty, it's really refreshing to work with engineering students that, um, how do I say this? These students put aside their, step outside their comfort zone, step outside their, their company, their country boundaries to use their um, problem solving skills to work in communities across the world. Um, we are making a difference. With every, what we do is we go into these villages and put in potable water systems to help these poor communities. And um, we're making a difference both in these communities, but for us, it's refreshing to watch the students realize that qualities such as humanity, humor, compassion, grace exist everywhere regardless of nationality or status. So on behalf of EWB, thank you. And um, just last week our team was in Ghana, so as they would say there, Openo.